Welcome back to Elden Ring, everyone. Uh, in today's episode, I thought what I was going to do is have a look around the rest of this zone here and sort of see if there is anything else here uh, that I can clear out or do before uh, getting to the boss. There will be a lot of edits here. Uh, as I mentioned, probably at the start of this playthrough, because of the nature of this game, I won't show everything. Obviously, if I showed every single event in this game, we'd still be here on the first playthrough like seven months from now. So there will be times like this where I will be recording uh, and sort of have everything going, but really only show you the interesting bits if anything happens, because what the hell? It oh, sh better get your rabies vaccine, boy. Damn. Talk about enemy variety. Holy shit. So yeah, uh, I completely... That com that bat fucked me up. Uh, yeah, so I have my like recording and everything going. And then you will see sort of like an abridged version of whether I find anything interesting. So... Speaking of... What up? the hell? Is this the demon of song? Okay, chill out. I have no idea what any NPC is talking about in this game. This is some side quest, for sure. Why should that matter? Storm Vale Castle still stands tall. That's what that's the castle. Cool. Okay, fuck off. We don't need to talk to her twice. Oh shit, we have something. Recusant Henricus. It's a knight. And it's an NPC invader. Cool. I was missing you guys. Okay, how much of a bitch are you gonna be? This is definitely something. And I knew it was something the moment uh, I the horse became avail unavailable. You can usually tell that some shit is gonna happen. Oh, come on. Don't tell me I didn't have the parry there. He has the mix-ups. Oh yeah? And do that shit too. It really remains to be seen how annoying the NPC invaders are in this game. Or in this version of the game. In this game, I should say. Uh, with From subtitles, it's always a mixed bag. You can end up with NPC invaders a la Bloodborne. Come on. Problem is that this. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna stop fucking around. I'm gonna stop fucking around. The issue is. <laughs> Shit. Oh, I'm empty. See, just. To me. I gotta say, the jumping attack seems kinda OD. Uh, it's just so useful. Hammer talisman. Oh yeah, I still need to figure out this, this talisman thing. Enhances stamina reducing attacks against blockers. Fire resist. Like, we haven't seen much fire. Uh, and stamina reduction seems and sounds fairly useful. So we're going to go for that. For now, for now. Can always turn out to be a nothing burger. What up, ghost? Wow. 
Why won't the door open? Oh, use Duelist's first fingers to write a red summon sign. Competitive multiplayer build. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know how to do multiplayer, believe me. So the question is, how is PvP in this game? That is the question for the ages. Uh, anytime a Souls game comes out for me. Although you guys know and I know that nothing will be ever a match to Dark Souls 2's PvP. You guys know I'm a sucker for that DS2 PvP. And I don't know if there's ever going to be a game to match that. I will try PvP in this game, for sure. And we'll see. We'll see how it is. Oh, now I can summon the horse. Cool. Oh, hey. What up? Forgive me. I've been she just appeared out of nowhere. Well, thanks. I can do to offer you now you're a true waifu. What is this? By grace. Like, it's not, not like we have an option. This is just like completely appeared out of nowhere. But we'll do it. Like, we're open to anything. You know, the one thing I'm like really, and maybe it's just I haven't found them in the big open world, is like merchants. The round table hold is a place where tarnished gather guided by grace. Combat is prohibited on the premises due to the pact of non aggression. The round table hold is located outside of this world. It can only be reached through sites of grace. It's the hub, it's a hub area. And it looks like we have dudes here as well. Hopefully some are going to be actually selling shit. You have cool armor. Is he my boss now? Fine. Look at that. Is that a staff? That is really cool. Yet to earn their keep. Remember your place, newcomer. Wouldn't be a Souls game without an NPC roasting you, right? Miracle Trainer. Let me guess, Miracle Trainer. 100% because this is the standard like Faith character, starting character. And I'm assuming that's the Sorcerer. Yeah. Incantations. You have a Logarius wheel on your head. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm not interested in the miracle trainer. I'm gonna be a hundred percent. We'll 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 have time for that. Don't worry. Well, what do you say? Care to learn an incantation of the two fingers? May the golden order shine through. Okay. Cool story, bro. Night. This guy might be evil. He looks like a bad guy. By the way, have you met a young woman named Lanya on your travels? She's my servant. But fickle as the wind. Take your eyes off her for but a moment and she's good as gone. I don't think we've seen someone like that. Please be sure to tell me. Maybe he's not evil. Be sure to tell me she's a servant to my house. She's yeah, 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 yeah. Cool then. Uh, 
there's plenty to look at here. All I want is a mm, sorcery trainer. You're not that, are you? Holy shit. What do you want? That is a power stance if I've ever seen one. See, the question in my mind is, if you're online, can you see like other players here? Offer a bell bearing, twin maiden husks. Ooh, okay. Rune, okay, what do you sell? Rune arc? These are expensive. <gasps> there we go. They sell some of the things I want. Nice, nice, nice. This is what I wanted. Uh, we're gonna need two daggers. The, the dagger is definitely something I want to use. Oh fuck, she only sells one. Damn. Well, okay, we'll do it one dagger for now. That's all good. Can't really talk to her, can I? Fuck yeah, we have a dagger. We're not fat rolling, that's all that matters. All right, well, this was already worth it. If I can find a sorcery trainer here, things would just be like, mwah. This is very cool. I didn't think there was going to be a hub area in this game. I thought that was like out of the question. Rest at table of lost grace. Pastime level up. Okay, you can do the same thing. Here's the thing. Did I I did purchase the quick step? Yes, 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 yes. So the keen has deck scaling. I mean we'll go for standard now because this already has okay deck scaling. Yeah, we can't, okay. You can't do the quick step either. Blacksmith, nice. The issue with the blacksmith is I barely have any upgrade materials. Sorcery? Huh? Yes? This, this this is a little bit sus here among us we'll we'll return to you in a little bit use dressing table what oh you can change your appearance shit nice by the way I didn't talk about it uh, but I named my character Sodom if you don't know who Sodom is he's like the main villain of Street Fighter Alpha and he's like an American, <clears throat> basically a weeb, uh, who dresses up as a samurai. I thought it only appropriate to name him Sodom. Fitting, you know. Because this is some weeb shit. You look kind of gross. Appropriately gross. I like his style. Does he have chains on his legs? Might as well strike up a conversation. Okay. Sure, there is a reason. We're gonna keep this conversation line going, make it awkward.
Yeah, you do look kind of crusty, I'm not gonna lie. Hmm, unfortunate. You don't sell, do you? No, you don't. Well, it's a bit of a shame. I This is because I was just about to say before coming over here that I feel like the biggest thing I'm missing... Oh, the biggest thing I'm missing right about now is uh, more upgrade materials. I feel like strengthening my weapons would go a really long way. Uh, to making just everything a little bit easier. You straight up can't go there. Interesting. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a quick like run around here again just to check that I have everything. And then I think we can leave if there is nothing left. Oh, hello there. This is a new door. Who do we have here, sorcerer? No, it's the same dude. This guy is such a dick. This is... Oh. Got you. Okay, so we basically have pretty standard FromSoft fare, like... It's just called Shardbearers and Great Runes, instead of Lords and Lord Swords and all that. You're a dick, so I knocked over your books. Peace out, bitch. Yeah, I think we're Gucci here, so we can uh, go back to the main world. Do you just, like, teleport out? I guess you do. So let's just take a look. Hell yeah. It's a dungeon. It's a gungeon. We also have this like big ass area here, so let's just torrent around the place a little bit. What up, boys? Oh, you're gonna get parried so badly. Or backstabbed, whatever. Can't wait to have two of these daggers. Parried to 408, man. I'm, I'm sure there's better daggers in this game as we move along. But for now, man, this is some good counter damage. All I need to do now is get a proper bastard sword, dump the katana, because katanas, if you haven't heard, uh, I heard through the grapevine called Twitter while scrolling through uh, during breakfast. Katanas are basically the meta of Elden Ring, as they've always been, uh, so no changes there. But I am gonna dump the katana because it's not the kind of build I'm going for here. There's a giant... What the actual shit is all of this? Is that a... I knew... I knew it! I was just about to say. I fucking knew it. Herba? Is that what they call it now? Lance Talisman, cool. Listen. Uh, yeah, uh, no. 
whatever we want to discuss, we will not discuss it. Uh, I'm gonna take a hike, so to speak. I think that was only the smart choice, really. Hello, lasting resting place is violated. Wait, I didn't catch that. To refuse the Earth Street call to return to live within death, sickening. Let's go. Let's enter. It's been a while since we've had a new dungeon. Death, death touched catacombs. Nice. I'm gonna guess if I if I had to hazard a guess, uh, I'm gonna say there's gonna be skellies. I can only count on skellies being here. This is the boss room. All right, chalice dungeon time. Yeah, I knew it. I mean, don't do the gesture, idiot. It could have only been skellies, right? What else? Luckily, there's actually like a decent way of taking <laughs> yes what else would a souls game be or a fromsoft game be without a rolling skeleton or two it's pretty much a series standard oh we got a free scimitar out of that i'll take that hey how do you how do you guys stand on upgrade materials it's what the boy wants. Cool. I do like that there is no like... I, I always think that's a treasure. I do appreciate that there is like no super convoluted way uh, like to kill the skeletons, you just hit them again. Because, you know, they oh, FromSoft always pull some bullshit with their skeletons. You need, like, a special weapon, uh, three types of weed applied to it, uh, and, I don't know, be in this covenant, and then you can kill the skeletons. Here is just hit them again, or they respawn. Which I think is pretty fair. This does lead to the same place, right? God, I always... Don't tell me that doesn't look like treasure. And each of these dungeons always has one of these ambushes. Have you guys noticed? Yeah, from soft skeletons. You can stand against the quick Elden Ring gameplay, right? <laughs> it's another Uchi. I really, I like inadvertently entered the meta of this game because dual Uchis or like dual Katanas, I think there's like some like bullshit ass weapon art you can get for them or Ash of War or whatever. And then you're just super OP. You know what? I'm. No, I can't ignore them because. I'm sure we're gonna get to the bottom as well, and they're just gonna be blasting me. Well, we can go to the bottom now. This is so far one of the easier dungeons, <clears throat> as I'm losing my voice. Just be nice to see as well. Where do you guys fucking come from? The question is if I critical them. Ah, 
they keep respawning even then. I think we've tried this before, even if you critical attack them, you still need to hit their corpse again. It doesn't like alleviate the need. Yeah, we're using big words. Get parried. Of course, the thing about the skeletons is this is uh, blunt damage territory, always has been. Uh, those are like super helpful against these guys. And slash and thrust does a little bit less damage. I'm guessing that's the same set of stairs, right? From the start. It looks like it. Yeah, it is. God damn it. <laughs> oh man, this dungeon fucks with you. I swear that's on purpose. That's gotta be, right? Anyways, again, uh, nothing super complicated. This, this, These are straight up chalice dungeons. Like, even the way you go through them... Like opening the door at the start. Super chalice dungeon like. The only question remains and... Okay, I nearly got killed. The only question remains is what type of... Um, skeleton boss we're gonna have at the start. Is it going to be a skeleton dog? Multiple skeletons? One like giant ball of skeletons? With this game, all bets are off. Uh, but... Let's not fuck around, let's find out. Okay, here we go. Do we have any NPCs? It's actually not something I've checked before. Uh, I'm not sure these like quick dungeons have summons but you never know no no they don't you also can summon your little minions either okay i'm mega curious what's it going to be black knife assassin that's not a skeleton what the hell bro i was expecting a skeleton and I feel like I got robbed. It's like some Artorius fanboy. Where did half his... Did I take drugs and like skip half a minute of gameplay? Or did half of his HP disappear? Oh, this is 100% someone you can parry. There has to be some trick to this. Maybe not, maybe he just turns it up to 11, like halfway through. I'm curious. Seriously, that's it? But, like, where the actual hell did most of his HP go? Like, I wasn't stoned, right? When I... Did he not have that at the... St okay. I don't trust ch treasure chests. I don't know the... Death route. This is a key. Uh, I don't know the... Mimic situation in this game, but... It's always better to be less trusting. Okay, so what, what what did we get? I got that stupid weapon, which I'm probably never gonna use. Uh, but let's just check around. That was a key item. Oh yeah, and we got this as well. Uh, Lance Talisman enhances attacks on horseback. Oh, I thought this was a weapon. Critical hits restore. See, now that's actually fairly useful, since I do use quite a bit of stealth. Uh, let's roll with that. Listen, we can always switch them out. 
Beast clergyman seeks and devours these, a source that gives rise to those who live in death. The beast clergyman found that bestial sanctum in the distant east collects and devours these roots. The night of the dire plot, the stone rune of death enabled the first death of a demigod. Later, the rune of death spread across the lands between through the underground roots of the great tree, sprouting in the form of death root. Jeez. Well, good or not so good for them, I guess. Okay, so... Where the actual fuck are you? Oh! Wait. Where is that Fortnite sound locator when you need it? So I was gonna say that... What the actual shit is that? Okay, I need to find this fool. Give me a sec. I bet he's like on the cliff or something. This, by the way, leads to... Looks like it leads to a new area. Where? Hello? What? This is near Automata, I swear. Hello? Like, like this thing looks again like something straight up near Automata. <laughs> I am it's a pot. And as you can see, I'm stuck here. You can Please. see that. Let's do it. I like him already. I'm not gonna mention any of the like five innuendos he just said there. Uh, no. Hmm. I don't have a weapon like that, do I? Unless... <laughs> Unless it works. Fuck. There we go. It did work. Good thing I didn't sell this shit. I was thinking about it too. Back to the Uchi we go. What a bruh. This guy's kind of awesome. Oh, that mighty wallop of yours almost spelled the end of me. <laughs> is this a uh, please tell me this is the Solaire of this game? Well, I'm out I really want a pod body. I thank you. And okay. as a token of my appreciation. I'm gonna position myself for the cutscene. Exalted flesh. Well thank you. Please tell me you can summon this guy. That would be just the sickest. That way, right? You don't have breasts, do you? Just saying. Yeah, yeah. Well, good luck. Yeah, and that definitely leads to some dungeon. Ah, oh, and there's another one right there. Man, this game is super dis it's distracting in a good way, I mean. When I say distracting, don't take it negatively. It's just... You know how it is. There's a dungeon here too. 
Fuck. I should mark it on my map, shouldn't I? I can't have my map, can I? Come on, let me hit you. There we go. Damn. And there's a boss. Or a boss fog. Like, what else could that be? Oh, no, it's not. It, the, lightning to the lighting totally made it look like there was a fog gate. Okay, can I have my map, please? Yes, thank you. So, uh, right here, right? Is that where the dungeon is? I mean, I guess it gets marked, but whatever. Oh, fuck. So something's gonna happen. Bloody finger Nerigus. Yeah. Okay, so whenever your horse goes away, uh, you better put your dukes up, you know. Nice dodge, bro. Listen, I'm a pro archer. Get on my level. Whoa! What the shit was that? That's the weapon I want. Dual daggers, fucking like blood dual attacks or some shit. That would be good. Okay, the good thing is you can try uh, enemy invaders multiple times, which is good. They just don't, they don't just like disappear and it's not tied to like you being in human form or some other bullshit like that. Please tell me you drop your weapon. And please tell me it's not like some int shit. Uh, did we just get a helper? Because I was just about to say, I'm going to be honest with you, I have no idea what the fuck is going on. <gasps> it's another samurai. Thanks, bro. It's a sombro. Please let me get that weapon. That was really cool. <gasps> I got it. This is mega cool. There's like actual NPC helpers as well. As in not just summons. Let me check this shit out. What do I need? God, this menu is confusing. 13 arcane. Ah, but it's only one. But... I can dual wield, can't I? What arcane am I at? Quickly, 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 quickly. Eight? Fuck. It's a long way away. Oh well. We have an objective to work towards. That is a mega cool weapon. Anyways, there's a dungeon here. Just coming in here to check if there's a resting spot. And there is, because I think with that I'm gonna go ahead and start wrapping up this episode of Elden Ring. Again, there's gonna be sometimes these like more abridged videos which depending on how many interesting things I find uh, are either going to be lengthy or not so lengthy. Still, uh, I think this was good. We got some good progress in. Uh, the thing I'm missing still is upgrade materials. I feel like having a plus two weapon for the boss would be really good at least. But if we don't get that, we don't get that. I'll wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Elden Ring. 
take care and make sure to like, comment and subscribe on the video and I'll catch all of you next time. Peace out and goodbye.